Hey guys, what's up? This is Gom, and welcome to Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. Now, before we get into this, I do want to say that I don't really know much about Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. Uh, I haven't been, like, watching trailers and learning what the story is, so we're going into this really, really blind. Uh, you know, <laughs> in comparison to other, other, you know, blind Let's Plays, at the very least, I'd watch a trailer and be like, Ah, oh, yeah, so uh, the person's gonna get the superpowers, and this time, it's not really gonna be like that. Uh, but we are on the PC, before we fully get into this, we're on the PC. I have pretty much every setting maxed out, it was, everything is generally maxed out by default. Actually, I am not at the advanced settings. The only things that I do not have maxed out are the texture quality. Or rather, is the texture quality because it requires six gigabytes of, <laughs> of video RAM, and my 780i only has three gigabytes. Boy, <laughs> I I don't know if the ultra textures are any like like significantly better to like really require six gigabytes of video RAM, but eh, whatever. I'm I'm not really gonna mind. Everything else is maxed out. I did the benchmark, and I was getting 70 to 80 FPS, so it's not like a badly optimized game at the very least. Uh, so that makes me happy, right? Like, anytime I get games on the PC nowadays, I'm worried that it's gonna be fucking something that runs at like 10 FPS on a 780i. Watch dogs! Uh, but you know what? I think we're ready to get this started. Now, we are actually gonna be playing with the Xbox 360 controller because I do feel that games that are in third person uh, That aren't like shooters or primarily shooters are probably better with the, th the Xbox 360 controller So since this is something more akin to like, you know, Assassin's Creed or the Batman Arkham series It's 360 controller time. Uh, oh, hello Trials of war, kill our captains and war chiefs in this open end challenges, change skins Ooh. Doc Ranger that's cool, actually. That makes him look like a fucking assassin. Oh my god. I'm sorry, there's gonna be a lot of comparisons with Assassin's Creed, but hey, you know what? This game might be a lot better than it. Let's see. Story mode time. In the land of Mordor, where the shadows lie, it was here. On the slopes of Mount Doom, that the Dark Lord Sauron was defeated by the last alliance of men and elves. It is here that for two and a half thousand years the Rangers of Gondor stood watch, guarding against a nameless threat they had all forgotten. And while the strength of Gondor faded, the power of Sauron ruled in darkness. He has returned to Mordor. Shadow and flame have fallen on the Black Gate. And no mortal man can stand in its path. You're oh. a perfect swing for killing chicken. Wouldn't want to hurt you. It'll take a lot more than that. <laughs> Dear Hyle, the mighty chicken killer. Come on. Come on. Show your father what you have, huh? Oh, he's my son? Oh, well, that sucks. <laughs> he's fucking dead. Ugh, he's my tutorial. All right, son, I'm learning from you. Hit harder if you want to best your father. Hard enough? Not really, he didn't actually hit me. Oh. Perry, son, don't forget to block. Perhaps you should not forget to hit. Oh, Stay you want me to hit you? Your enemy will not always be as he appears. <laughs> I'm gonna dick to my son and just beat his ass up. Oh! Easy, son. You're not a soldier yet. Oh, that 
the old gun. Well, shit, he fucking learned properly. Hold RT for her. Oh, alright. Ground execution. Hold on, I'm sprinting near to tackle. Oh, God. It's gonna be really weird to try and, like, care about the story while also tackling everything else. Alright, let's sprint, tackle, or oh, he's dead already. Damn it, Deer Hill! So, how long ago was the training? Was it like the day before? Or was it like, you know, a year before and he got a lot better? Because I could see that. I guess it doesn't really matter. He's dead now. Oh, gosh. Oh, I can grab him and just shank them like that. That's good. Okay. These orcs are much stronger than any we've ever seen. They're not orcs, they're orcs. They're far worse. There's too many. Go find your mother. Go find your mother. Keep her safe. I'll be right behind you. Go. Am I dead? You are banished from death. Oh! That wasn't creepy. Um, my wife's dead too. Dude, your luck is shit. Press X to present flower and court the lady. That's that's what I'm anticipating. <laughs> While in stealth, press X to kiss your wife. I knew it. All right, court the lady. Sup? <laughs> stealth kissed. Happy anniversary, my love. Alien, this is beautiful. Where did you find it? I still have a few friends left in Gondor. Did you talk to my father? Yes, I did. And nothing has changed. He's still very stubborn. I say we go anyway. Dear I will not come willingly. There must be a better life than this. Not now. But soon. I'm just so tired of hiding here, Italian. <laughs> Must hide now, or we are both dead. Come on. We should have left when we had the chance. It's a little late for that. I'll clear a path. I'm outnumbered. Stealth is my only advantage. We should be a fine battle. Three people? I was just fighting like a whole bunch of them. I mean, I guess it was a 2v something, but. Oh, oh boy. Alright, so I can only stealth while holding down the right trigger. I have to remember that, because it's really tempting to just, like, release it. Huh? No! Shit! The sword down, Ranger. Take 
Oh god. Now, do you believe me, Ranger? What has happened to me? You are banished from death. Cast adrift between the worlds of light and dark. Curse binds us together within the walls of Arda. If what you say is true, then how do we break this curse? We find the one who cast it on us. The Black Hand of Sauron. Well, that's a pretty simple goal. Kill the asshole who killed us. our lives to Gondor. Did I just hear exposition? Oh god. This is gonna be one of those games where, I'll be honest, I probably will be really lost because I, again, I'm not a fan of Lord of the Rings series. It's not that I dislike it, it's just I've never gotten into it. So, I have no idea what's going on. Reforged. Ooh, I'm gonna make a new weapon. Unlocking Forge Towers unlocks the Wraith's Memories. This unlocks new missions, collectible locations on the map, and Mirian. Oh. So... These are like, the Assassin Towers, boy. Okay. Exactly like the fucking towers. Ow! So, we missed one of you at Narcos, eh? An easy mistake to fix. Oh, they can see me. I thought I was a ghost. Oh, hello, fucking ghost bow. Eliminate the Erex. Hold LT to enter range mode. And dead. You will suffer for what you've done. Uh oh. Yeah, fine, I'm fucking attack him. Holy shit! Guys! I became awesome in death! Go back to me.
Interrogate the fallen Uruk. All right, grab and then press A to interrogate. Sup? What do you know of the Black Hand of Sauron? He is a fiend. Made of thin air. What more? A slave I had. Swears he fought him. I sold him for a cake of grog to Gimu the Slaver. Ah. These are the captains of Sauron's army. They appear as shadows because you don't you don't yet know their identity. By interrogating enemies, you can uncover valuable information about these captains. Press A to learn the identity of this captain. Oh. Gimub the Slaver. You have learned of Gimub's identity, this will help you hunt him down. His title, the Slaver, gives you clues about his role in Uruk society. Yeah, he enslaves people, I got that. He's a veteran captain, you've also learned his power rating. This gives you an indication of how difficult he will be to defeat. The power rating also determines your rewards for defeating him. Rewards include runes to upgrade your weapons and increasing your own power to unlock ability tiers. The map and objectives show you where this captain can be located. Mode of hoping a slave tries to escape soon, wanting to make an example. Hmm. Oh yeah, this is gonna take me a while to get into. Some thoughts might lie. He might just be a complete idiot. You know? Tutorial. Missions. It's more tutorials. Alright. Goat icons advance the story. Red icons display power struggles where Uroks compete for status. Uh, white icons rep represent side missions and collectibles. Okay, you have two available main missions. The slavers slave the humans trapped within Mordor and find the Black Captains. The Spirit of Mordor learn more about Uruk society and take down Sauron's army from within. Alright, well I'll do both of those. Do I finally have open reign of the world? Sort of? This changed. Nothing makes sense. Nothing has changed. This is how it will be. The future and the past are linked in darkness. I don't understand why I'm here. And I can't remember. Let's go find the slaver. His mind may provide answers. Hey, Die. fellas. Uh-oh. We cannot allow these guys to kill a... There are no humans. What am I talking about? Okay. I guess I'll just have to survive or something. See, I don't know. I saw these guys had green icons above their head, and I was like, they're friendlies. Uh, apparently not. Hold up! Get- Whoa! Got you an execution! Tutorial awareness. The icon above an oryx head displays his awareness. Yellow indicates his, he's investigating disturbance. Red, 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 Okay, got you. Damn it, I'm trying to execute him! I can't execute him if you guys are constantly attacking me! Whoa! I'm gonna skin ya! Fly ya! Do you wanna be dead when it happens? Is this a captain? Oh no! A captain came out of fucking nowhere in the middle of my starting fight! Fine, I'll just kick his ass! Wait, I'm gonna knock him down, down to the fucking ground! And then I'm gonna execute him! Uh-huh! Oh, fuck! Hey, buddy! You threw me down to the ground! We can't have that! I probably should have interrogated him. Oh well. What is this? Oh. Runes. Got you. Okay. Orc Slayer. Combat finishers do extra damage against captains. Uh, smite level 4. Recover 37% focus on a flurry kill. Well, uh, I think I'll get the Orc Slayer. <laughs> that DLC rune for pre-ordering. 
Oh, that is so fucking awesome. We basically use the Wraith as a secondary attack. Okay. Well, that was very interesting. Uh, I should really interrogate captains, though. I saw the talk scare Hawk so badly he dropped his axe. I'll take the axe back by burying it in his skull. Shameless little coward. Alright, let's see if he keeps his back turned. Uh oh. Hey, friend! Wait. Need to talk to you! Okay, so who is this? Ratbag the Coward? Don't care about him. I could learn about... This guy. Gura the Puny. Haughtily laughing at a slave's pain and suffering. And he's all the way over to the left side. Got you. Ah, uh, we don't need to go after him. Yeah, I just cut off his head. Do you want to still come after me? Yeah, he still wants to come after me. Yes! Run, humans! I'll be busy gaining information from him. Okay, we'll just keep on interrogating. We'll find out. What about this guy? Taz, the bowmaster. Oh. Okay, that guy's power level 8. We're not going to go over there. <laughs> We're just going to go off and do the main mission. Or a main mission. It's just there are so many enemies, and I love killing enemies. Where was you earlier? Out hunting? Nah, I was guarding slaves at the dig. Did you hear that? Worthwhile. Hey, I'm doing ghost whispers. Come over here. This Sup? Alright. I'm gonna interrogate you in the bushes. So that way... I'll probably still be seen while I'm doing it. But I just wanna find out everybody. As dush the rank. Okay. Alright, so none of the beginning captain dudes are in this area. Good. That's all I want to know. Okay. Oh, they... do they have bows? I don't know, I heard a shot. But I guess I'm just crazy. I'm gonna leave now. I don't need to fight every single person available. Although... I do think that if I keep on practicing my killing... I can become better! And more skilled! Something that I desperately need to be able to do as I get into this game. Holy shit, I just fucking threw his ass to the ground. I'm like, nah, out of here. Ow. Okay, so I just did a little experiment to see if I was immune during my executions. I am not. So I might as well just randomly beat down to them until they die of their own accord. I can also do this. Keep away from his hands! <laughs> because that's really gonna protect you! I'm gonna kill the little guy. There. <gasps> what does draining do? I have no idea. I think that probably refills my, uh... My focus bar, which I hadn't really used much of. But alright, earn XP to gain ability points and unlock powerful new abilities. Play power struggles to earn power more quickly and unlock ability tiers. Okay, well, what do I have? When your hit streak is charged, press Y to Y and B to execute your target. Ooh, that sounds good. Impact. Counter enemies will be knocked backward or stunned. Uh, aerial takedowns. Ooh, that's definitely something that I'll probably need. Like, absolutely. 
Time your landings. Tap A when mantling over obstacles to gain a temporary speed boost. Oh, that sounds so cool. Oh, I want all these basic ones, at least. And I imagine there are, like, shitloads of awesome things. Flames of Revengeance. Striking enemies with a glowing sword will deal double damage. Oh, Jesus. Alright. Well, we'll actually save that for now. I don't know what I'm gonna need in the future. Although, let me heal myself real quick. With all the talk about it, 